Welcome to G Reminders Team Scheduling. In this video, we'll discuss what team scheduling is and how to set it up. Team scheduling includes random round robin scheduling of several team members, great for initial meetings, customer support, or service calls. You can allocate each member of the team equally or specify which team members should get priority and be scheduled first. Both are based on availability. There is also altogether team scheduling, where all team members must be available in order to schedule a meeting with the team. Let's take a look at how to set everything up. Before you can schedule team events, you must have two or more users on your account. You can invite users by simply emailing them an invitation to join. You determine if they will have administrative privileges or standard user privileges. Now let's create our first team. Click on Create New Team. Create a team name and choose the members who will be part of the team. Notice there are several menu items at the top of the team window. Under Members, you can add or remove members or assign manager status to other members. Under the Settings menu, you can edit your team name and choose a team photo and also a banner that's unique to this team and will appear on the online team scheduling calendar. We'll look at reports after we schedule a team meeting. Next, let's create our first team event. We'll select Round Robin as the type of event. Next, create a name for the event and a short description people will see when they schedule with the team. We'll leave all team members allocated as priority, so the system will schedule each randomly. Team members can each meet in a different location, online or in person. We can choose other options for this meeting, like duration, when clients can schedule, etc., just like individual events. We'll add the name of this event to the invite. Then save. You can see that the event is marked Round Robin on the Teams page. We can view the team link by choosing the View Team Link button. Looking at our scheduling calendar, you'll notice all times are available for this event because there is at least one team member available for each time. Let's take a look at each team member's Google Calendar. Team members Mary and Brad both have appointments scheduled at 2 p.m. on Wednesday, but not Pete, leaving that time available to schedule. So let's schedule an appointment for that time. Of course, the appointment was allocated to Pete, since he was the only team member available. That time will now be blocked on the calendar. Looking at the team report, we can see this appointment has been added. If we wish to allocate the appointments differently, we could simply change the priority level for each team member. Now Brad will get appointments booked first, then Pete, then Mary. Make sure to save any changes. Next, let's create an all-together team event. We complete the event template as before, indicating who will be the organizer and where the event is to take place, along with other standard event options. The All Together Team event has been added to our team scheduling calendar. When we select the event, you'll notice that only times when all members of the team are available are open on our scheduling calendar. If one member of the team has a conflict, the time for an All Together Team event is blocked. Let's schedule a meeting with the team.
You can see the appointment is on Brad's, Pete's, and Mary's Google Calendar. Once again, the appointment is recorded in the team report. We can create additional teams made up of different individuals. Create as many teams as you like. Finally, we can create reminders to go out to individuals who have scheduled. Each team member can create their own reminders for round robin events, if the admin allows users to manage their own reminders, and the organizer creates a reminder for the all together events. Team scheduling is a powerful feature that helps you make sure that there are individuals at your firm who are available to handle initial appointments, support questions, and service calls. It's available with any G Reminders paid plan and during your free trial. If you have questions, reach out to us or schedule a one on one onboarding call with one of our customer success representatives. If you haven't tried G Reminders yet, sign up for a free trial today. Happy scheduling!